What's crackling, everybody? Welcome back once again to the definitive cereal tier list, where each episode we take a cereal, put it on the tier list, so you know how good it is. I'm your host, Tucker. In this episode, we're doing Marshmallow Cocoa Pebbles. We've done all the other modern pebbles at this point, like, of course, Cocoa Pebbles itself, which got a B, Fruity Pebbles at an A, Fruity Pebbles with marshmallows, dropped down to a B. We did peanut butter and cocoa pebbles, that was a C. There's a birthday cake pebbles too. It's, a, it's just been a lot of pebble stuff. But the highlights so far have been fruity at A, cocoa at B. What's interesting about this as well, is just recently we did cocoa dino bites, which is the multi meal version of cocoa pebbles. Normal version of that got a C with marshmallows, still got a C, but it was just smothered with marshmallows, like an uncontrollable ratio. So hopefully that doesn't happen with this one because it was a bit, a bit much with that. So I'd much prefer a, a balance here, but we'll see. Hopefully it's just the, the, the good taste and, and pebbles feel we all love from Cocoa Pebbles. And there's a bit of addition of marshmallows in there just for more fun. And it's that, I think we'll be good. But let's just open it up, see what it's like. It looks like the marshmallows might be a little chocolatey themselves, just off the image. I'm not entirely sure about that. No, they still look pretty white in here. Yeah, that's no. It's a couple of pebbles, for sure. Didn't change that. Okay. So they are a little different. Not as white as they looked in the box. There also seems to be much more just like specks floating about in here than normal cocoa pebbles. Like there is obviously cocoa powder a lot, but Feels like a lot more visible pieces this time. And good news at this moment, ratio looks like it's normal. So nothing too low or too high. So we're off to a good start, just aesthetically. Okay. This is a weird twist, but this version tastes a bit more like Cocoa Dino Bites than normal Pebbles does. I don't know if I'm imagining that, but that'd be a funny twist because as we've covered before, post Malto meal, they're, they're the same. So that'd be a little funny if this time I copied off of Malta meal. I'm very confused by this. I thought this was going to be normal pebbles. Maybe this is my head. We'll, we'll keep going and see if I'm imagining this. So I confirmed the marshmallows are chocolatey just a little bit. So then I thought, oh, maybe that's sort of what's bringing in this Cocoa Dino Bites taste. So I tried a bite where I pretty much managed to get only pebbles pieces. I'm going to do it again here just for video evidence. Yeah, it's still making me think of Cocoa Dino Bites. I don't know why they did this to me. I feel, I feel tricked after, after the trust I put in Pebbles. So that's a bit of a letdown, I think. The marshmallows themselves, like I mentioned, the chocolate flavor in there, it's kind of neat, makes them distinct from a lot of the other marshmallows we've had. So points there, but not enough points to offset this this betrayal. All right, the milk is looking plenty chocolatey, so let's give it a taste. Okay, again, reminding me of Cocoa Dino Bites, not Cocoa Pebbles. 
That's okay. I, had, I think it's still an all right chocolate. Oh, come on. I keep getting pebble species. Our marshmallows on the bottom of the spoon. Let me have just the milk, please. Yeah, it's okay. Like this whole thing is pretty much just Cocoa Dynabites and Cocoa Pebbles boxing. So milk doesn't really change anything about that. Cocoa Pebbles has managed to pull off a top 10 anime betrayal here. So overall, I do think this cereal is okay, but I was expecting a lot more from Cocoa Pebbles. Like I understand Cocoa Pebbles, Cocoa Dynabites, same company and all that, but usually the core version is stronger. This time it feels like they just kind of went with the Malta meal version, switched up the marshmallow flavor a little bit, did decrease the marshmallow ratio, but it's still pretty high, so it's still getting a lot of marshmallows. Not quite as over the top as with Cocoa Dynabites with marshmallows, still maybe hold back just like a tiny bit. Maybe I have like three less marshmallows in that bowl. I think would be okay. So yeah, I, I think a lot of my disappointment with this is coming from just the expectation more so than the cereal itself. Though the cereal itself is just okay. So what I'm going to do is give Marshmallow Cocoa Pebbles a C. Same rank as the Cocoa Dynabites and Cocoa Dynabites with marshmallows. And I think that makes a lot of sense going off of what I've been saying here. It's very similar. Like, it could easily just be the Cocoa Dynabites with marshmallows if they just switched the marshmallows between the two. So I think it makes a lot of sense to put it there. Though I will say that marshmallow difference does count. Like, they get some props for that. It's, it's cool to have a bit of chocolate taste with a marshmallow and not have it as crazy an abundance of them, but I don't think it's enough of a change to move it up or anything. Like this definitely is not going to be a B with just core Cocoa Pebbles because that has a much, much better chocolate taste than this does. So it it's kind of the only spot I can put this is at a C and it's going to be almost in line pretty close with the Cocoa Dynabites with marshmallows. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to like and subscribe and in the comments below post your general thoughts. Let me know if you've had marshmallow cocoa pebbles and what you think of it. It's a bit of a newer cereal, like past few months or so I'd say, so might not have had a chance yet. If you do, you can let me know what you think. If you are a huge fan of the Cocoa Dynabites, marshmallow or no marshmallow, and you think this is actually better because it is like those, you can let me know. Or maybe because it's like those, but you're getting so much less for the price, maybe you dislike this and it's a kind of a flip and melt the up on top for you. You can let me know. Or if you think this is better just because you really like those chocolate marshmallows, you can let me know about that too. But until next time, stay delicious.